Hello guys, Lifehackster here. Quick video today and this is to compare the video footage of Eufy's 4K battery cameras. We have the Eufy Cam 3 and the 3C and we'll compare it to their 2K models which there's a lot of them. We have the Eufy Cam 2 Pro, the Eufy Cam 2C Pro, Solocam E40, L40, S40, and the new S220 and the C210. I know it is confusing, but I'll use the Eufy Solocam S40 or the S230 in this video and compare it to the Eufy Cam 3 and we'll see if it is worth it to go with the pricier 4K instead of 2K. And you have to wait till the end because I'll show you an objective data that will surprise you. And it surprised me. So keep on watching. Now I decided to make this video because Eufy has released yet another version of their 2K battery cameras. Like the Solocam S220 which I did review and I will link it down below if you haven't seen it yet. And also they now have the Solocam C210. Which I think the only difference between the S220 is that it doesn't have a solar panel. And comparing it to the Solocam S230 which used to be the S40 is that the S40 has the spotlights. Now I have a bone to pick with Eufy on how they named these cameras. They changed the Solocam S40 to the Solocam S230 so that it can be differentiated with the S220. But why C210 and not S210? And another one, when I initially reviewed this camera when they first released it, it was just the Eufy indoor camera. Then eventually they named it C24 and then a few weeks ago they changed it again to C120 which just confuses customers. Anyway, so I digress and let's get back to the video. Now in this video, we'll just compare the video quality 2K versus 4K. Assuming they use the same compression between these 2K models. So just by video quality alone, is there a big difference to justify the difference in price? Well, let's find out. By the way, the footage comparison will be between the Eufy Cam 3 which is a 4K camera and the S40 or the S230 which records in 2K. So this is the video on audio quality. We're comparing the uh, UV uh, Cam S40 and the uh, UV Cam 3. And then video player test at 10 feet. 15. 20. 25. 30. 35. 40. So this is the video on audio quality. We're comparing the uh, UV uh, Cam S40 and the uh, UV Cam 3. And we declared test at 10 feet. 15. 20. So this is the video quality of the UV Solcam S40 or the S230 and this with its spotlights turned on and this one looks like at 10 feet, 15, 20, 25, 30. This is the video quality of the UV Cam 3 at night and the spotlight turned on and this is what it looks like at 10 feet, 15, 20, 25, 30. So this is the video quality of the UV Solocam S40 at night and this with its four infrared LEDs turned on and this is what it looks like at 10 feet, 15, 20, 25, 30.
So this is the Mega Quarry of the Yuffie Camp 3 at night, and this with its uh, 6 different LEDs, and this one looks like a 10 p 15, 20, 25, So what do you think? Are you able to see a big difference in video quality between the 4K and 2K? Personally for me, not a lot of difference. And I set both of these cameras to record a full minute so that we can compare the file sizes and bitrate. The Eufy Cam 3 records in 3840 by 2160 at 15 FPS and has a total bitrate of 2407 kbps and a total file size of 17.5 megabytes in a one minute clip. Now the S40 on the other hand records in 2304 by 1296 at 15 frames per second and a total bit rate of 1675, which we already assumed that it's gonna be lower than the 4K and has a total file size of 12 megabytes. But what is very interesting are the night recordings. The S40 has the same bitrate, 1675 kbps and 1625 in infrared night vision, which is still the same 11 to 12 megabyte file in a one minute recording. But the Uficam 3 is only 660 kbps, which results to only less than a five megabyte file in a one minute clip. And this is for color night vision. And a bit higher, but still lesser than 2K, 1211 kbps in infrared night recordings, which is about a nine megabyte file. This really surprised me and I have to make sure that I double check the recordings in my Eufy Cam 3C and the same thing. So I'm not sure why the bit rate for their 4K cameras go down at night and way lesser than their 2K cameras. Video quality though, there's not a lot of difference between the two, but they could definitely be better. I personally want to see more 4K cameras from Eufy and it would be nice if they can use a lesser compression to really differentiate and separate it from their 2K cameras. For now, there's not a lot of difference that will justify the extra cost of their 4K cameras. Plus, there are more options that you can choose on their 2K models. Well, that's it for this video. Thanks for watching.